Beautiful queens, handsome kings. How are you doing? Pisces, welcome to Unique and Unapologetic Tarot. Subscribers, unsubscribers, and cross watchers, welcome. I almost said Scorpios. What y'all got going on with a Scorpio? Hmm? Let's see, get y'all angel card and see what's going on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Workshop and seminars. Intended and giving speeches is part of your spiritual path and purpose. Be open to teaching and learning. Okay, so maybe y'all supposed to be um, going to a webinar or teaching a webinar. Pisces. Let us know. See what's going on. Mm -hmm. mm. All right, well, y'all letting somebody from the past. Go. Yeah, y'all don't have happy memories with whoever this person is from your past. Mm. No. Y'all moving forward. You're leaving home and you're going to be independent. Six cups of it. Yeah. Three of Wands right after. Y'all going on the journey. Ain't no doubt. Yeah. Because this situation. Had you fatigued, tired, restless, and you don't want to fight no more. Nope, you're not going to fight no more in this battle. You done fighting in this battle. Whoever this is, yeah, you done. You're exhausted. And you question this person's motive. And the blindfold ain't on no more. You done made your choice. You made your choice to walk away from this, whatever it is, because you feel like it was a lack of teamwork. You forget you feel like it was a lack of teamwork. Maybe it's the third party, but right now we see it's a lack of teamwork. Three pentacles upside down. Yeah. There was a lack of teamwork in this union. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And this union had you feel like you was in self imprisonment. Had you on your knees, baby. Had you on your knees. Yeah. You feel like you was in self imprisonment, but all you had to do was stand up and go. Mm-hmm. Mm. But you done made the choice. Mm. There was a lot of lies and illusions, Pisces, at the end of this. Maybe it was this is Pisces and Cancer. I, I don't know. But, hey, the moon. There was a lot of illusions and lies. But there was a lot of illusions up in this motherfucker. Yeah, a lot, a lot of illusions. Yeah. And you want balance. Yeah. Dang. You say you've been patient long enough and you want balance. Mm -hmm. okay. Somebody ate. Somebody tested the wrong waters testing yours. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there was a lot of secrets in this situation. And like I said, maybe it is a third party because this could be a mistress too. Yeah, and I, I don't always, I look at, depending on the surrounding cards, three of pentacles or three of cups can be a uh, third party to me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There was a lot of secrets, a lot of lies. That Yeah. But this, it was built on a faulty foundation. It, the, hey. It was, hey, it was never, it was built on a faulty foundation. Yeah, 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 it was. So, the foundation broke down, but you avoided a disaster. <laughs> now, the foundation, it's a time moment, and it's upside down, but the, you avoided a disaster, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Because you were fearing to suffer with this person. Yeah. Look, you got it again. Damn. Yeah. This had you tired and restless. And look, not, you got twice. 
And this time, and they both upside down. Yeah, you you was all, You really questioned whoever this person was. They motives. I I don't know if it was a lover. Yeah, but look at the bottom. There was a lot of conflict. There was some betrayal. They they were stealing. Stealing ain't always about the money either. Your time is somebody stealing. Yeah, this person, look. Look. Somebody did something impulsive. Yeah. Somebody did some impulsive ass overbearing shit to you to say that I'm done. I'm done. And you see that y'all not going to be able to achieve. What you was expecting to achieve in this relationship is, is unachievable. Yeah. But you're still working hard. Look, you're working hard. Maybe you're working hard to walk away, but you're working hard. You're working hard in the situation. Yeah. 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 You clean the sword on their ass. you off with their head. You cut out any uh, lies. You, this is like the high priestess to me. You cut out anything. That it's not for your good. You defend yourself, your home, your family. But the hey, Queen of Swords always knows the truth and cuts out all bullshit out her life. But no problem. That's for that's the queen that's gonna holler off with your head. Yeah, and mean it. Mm -hmm. Look, this situation is over. This situation it's death to this situation. You end in this situation for you to have new beginnings. Yeah. You made a heart, head over heart decision to walk away from this person, whoever this person is. And like I said, it might not be love. It could be anything. It could be a partnership, a friendship, a family member. But whoever it is, hey, you're making a head over heart decision because you already know the truth about the situation. The King of Swords knows the truth just like the Queen of Swords. They know the truth. Yeah, they know the truth. And you have enough discipline to walk away. Because you weren't going to let this situation burden you. You wasn't. You already was tired. You said, I'm not picking up that third one. I'm not. You refuse to let this situation be a burden to you. You know? Look. You didn't want it to be. Look, because it burnt you out. There was a lot of conflict. Look, there was a lot of conflict in this relationship. A lot of conflict. Look at all these wands. Look, and at the bottom, at, at the bottom, high front, upside down, this person, whoever it was, was so bad. They didn't have no morals, no ethics about themselves at all. I don't know who this is, but you, hey, yeah. There was a lot of rivalry, competition, and conflict up in this motherfucker. Yeah. Because they didn't have whoever this person you riding with didn't have no morals or ethics. Yeah. Yeah. You going on a new journey. It's telling you you're going on a new journey. Hey, you're actually innocent in this situation. Crosswatcher might say you're not, but it's time for you to move forward. Yeah, time for you to move forward. Time for you to move forward. Yeah, baby, and you are too. Look. News is coming in. Not not once. News is coming in. Some kind of letter is coming on in to you. But look, you the Knight of Wands is fear, they make fearless moves. And you are hey, and you love action. You, you hey, your action was to walk away from this. Yeah. Cause look, somebody yeah, yeah, I was warned. You was warned with somebody. And whoever you was warned with made a post of as speedy. They did. They did something impulsive, speedy, and they disregarded the consequences that was going to happen to them for them making that move against you. They disregarded it. Yeah. Why? I don't know. But they they disregarded the consequences that was going to come. With, yeah. Look. Because you moving on. You moving on. Yeah. You don't want no more confusion. You don't want to be around nobody. Got a whole bunch of multiple choices. Look. You, you out of there. You moving on out of this situation. Mm-hmm. Mm. Told you somebody was in the third party situation. Look at the bottom. Somebody was in the third party situation. Now third party situations ain't loving. 
Sometimes it's in partnerships. Sometimes it's, hey, sometimes that the other cousins teamed up with your other cousin. Hey, maybe it's, maybe it's a sibling shit. Quit acting like if there wasn't motherfucking Seth and Orses, Cain and Abel. Should I keep on going? Yeah. But ain't no happy memories in this situation no more. There's none. You knew this person. You knew this person from the past. This person's been in your life. Like I said, it could be, it could, it, look. Whatever it is, you go, you're going to be independent and you're moving on from whoever this person is. This could be, like I said, a lover, family member, friend. But it's somebody you used to have happy memories with. But you don't have happy memories with them no more at all. Because you feel like this motherfucker is smug and they are not your wish fulfillment. Like, subscribe, comment, Pisces. I love you, my beautiful queens and my handsome kings. Until the next time, stay safe in this pandemic.